Hey guys, Al from Borders here. This guy is called the Salomon High Path. Another one in the higher end of the Salomon range. Basically doing these reviews because everyone's about to head to the Northern Hemisphere and these are the boards I'd recommend you take. This guy's an all mountain direction tape and all drew directional tapered board with um, rock out camber. So the camber is relatively normal, pretty decent amount of camber in the middle and then rocks out at the end. So if you're a side hit guy, like if you're going over there with your family and the kids are riding and you kind of got to keep an eye on them and you just want to hit side hits all day, but you're going to get a couple of hours in the Arvo to go into the back country, this board's perfect. So you could ride this board in the resort just launching off side hits, super fast base, really, really responsive board. Not crazy stiff, but in, in the more responsive end of the world. It's got the recycled ABS sidewalls and the recycled sintered base. So really fast board. It's got an Aspen Select core, so it's quite light. Um, poppy, responsive. You can set it back so that you can ride it in the deeper snow. Like if you pull right back here, it's a pretty short tail. Still a bit of flex through the tail. It's not crazy stiff. So intermediate and up, no problem at all. Obviously not a beginner board, but it doesn't mean you can't learn to drive in a Ferrari. You know, you could ride this no matter who you are. The, the base is quick on these boards. They're super fun to ride. The Salmon High Path is an absolute weapon for carving. It's playful enough to hit side hits and in deep snow, it works really well. It's still very much a directional board set back. It's going to float probably 80% as well as some of the pure powder boards. So Salomon High Path, if you're uh, looking for a really good looking board that's not crazy expensive for Japan or North America or wherever you're going in Europe, this is the guy. Jump on it. High Path.